Good morning. Oh, you want Chick-fil-A? Okay. Listen, boy. You ain't gotta tell me twice. Can you give that back to your brother? It's very not nice to take things from someone when they're playing with them. Roman throws the funniest two for tantrums. But today is going to be better than yesterday. I believe it. Because I'm um, just putting good vibes out there. No. Stay out of my top drawer. The remote is not a toy. I last night had the weirdest thing all of a sudden happen. It was like my legs, the back of my thighs and specifically the back of my calves, like they ate so bad, it was like I was injured and had been for like ever. And Sam and I tried, he was like, try this, try this position, try this, try putting a pillow on your legs. Like I tried a couple different things and it did not stop. So I ended up having to take Tylenol and as soon as it kicked in, I finally was able to fall asleep after midnight. It was the weirdest thing. Look at this gremlin. Do you see that gremlin? <laughs> then we got this gremlin here. Hey, 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 uh-uh, uh-uh, no, sir. Where did Ezra go? Where did Ezra go? I don't see him. I don't see him. I don't see Ezra. Roman, where's Ezra? Where's Ezra? Oh, yeet. Where's Ezra? Gremlins. Oh, you just sat on your brother? Well, I was trying to make the bed, but anyways, today is gonna be a better day than, yes, than last week, last Wednesday. It's been one week today since we had the PACI. So, we're doing good, uh, right? Where did Ezra go? Single day, like this lovely thing right here, it's gotta go in the new year after because they keep playing with the moss, like Roman plays with it. Today, I'm supposed to get a number of my Amazon orders in. I did get a couple of things like last minute for the, the trip. Um, yeah. Yeah, oh, your hair would be looking crazy. Can you tell me you've been trying to talk? Say shoe. Shoe. Say milk. Shoe. Milk. He said milk yesterday. Um, Ezra's first like legit word was banana. He would say banana. And now it's banana. What is that on the dog? Bro, no, that is not. Hand me those. Board. I would throw a pumpkin away because it had like sharp pieces on it. I've had that since from like at home since before the boys were born. Anyway. Um, so today I did place an order for some last minute little travel things from Amazon. Some things I buy over and over, like I'm, a, I'm just not someone who reuses those little travel toiletry kits because they're gross and they're hard to store and you never know the gap of time that you're gonna use in between them. So what I do is I take all my travel toiletries and then I just toss the actual thing before I come back. So I grabbed, an, it's the same brand I use like pretty much every time. Um, I grabbed one of those. I also grabbed a bag because this is the first time traveling with prescription medication. Um, what else, what else, what else? I grabbed something to carry my hot tools in. Um, cause that is something I've struggled with in the past. It's like, you gotta let that hot tool cool down before you pack it up. You are. So I'll show you guys all that when it comes in. And then I also need to know, do you guys have used, love, hate the Apple over the ear noise canceling headphones? I kind of want them because I, after a while, find earbuds to be very uncomfortable. But at the same time, like I might find over the ear headphones to be uncomfortable, but they're also very expensive. So it's like, if you have them, do you like them? <laughs> Let a girl know, right, Ro? Oh, okay. Yeah. Say, let mommy know. <laughs> All right, 
I go get the other one. Put it, yeah, good job. You have to look forward when you're walking, Ezra. I don't keep my head facing behind me when I'm walking. Alright, you gotta do this. Hold on. I think it was, how did your daddy do this? Was it like this? Yes, that's what it was. Here, let's do this one. You need to open up those windows. It is like not right in here. Okay. definitely super unflattering but I got in my travel stuff so I figured I would share um because these are like repurchased like I get a lot of the same brand items like I was mentioning earlier so what's that saying it's like the guy from new girl he says I'm not being over dramatic when I would rather sit naked on a hot grill than wear something off the rack I would rather sit naked on a hot grill than get in a hotel shower barefoot i get shower shoes um these are the exact ones i wore at the hospital with my babies and they grip very good so they are not cute and they're not meant to be they serve a purpose and that works this is because i'm just a gigantic baby now and can't sleep without a sound machine i have never been one of those people but after you have babies beside you in bassinets and they need a sound machine you you get used to it this like teeny tiny little thing. No, I don't does it have any battery. It doesn't. And then this is all the other stuff. We have got the little case for cords. Again, I have some of these that are bigger, but I needed something that was a little small to fit in my carry on um, because I am taking 100% of my tech items in my carry on. Um, I told you guys I am flying first class because like the price difference wasn't that much. So I'm really excited about it. And you also get two checked bags and a carry on, um, which is really nice because I um, was told by someone who's going to the event or who has been to the event in the past to take an empty suitcase because they give you a lot of stuff and you want to be able to get it home and not have to buy another suitcase. This, oh, praise God, it's actually big. I hate when I've ordered things like this in the past and they come in and I'm like, what hot tool is that supposed to fit? So I got this hot tool travel bag because um, it never fails. I'm like that person who's standing there staring at my curling iron or straightener. Like, why are you not cool enough to put in my suitcase? Like, let's go. So got this, it is supposed to be, got a little mat here. So you can put your curling iron and straightener on it, but also can throw it down in this bag. So that's nice. There's a little spot for like bobby pins or something. This I needed because this is just my first time traveling with prescription medication. Never done that before. I'm sure people don't have problems with it, but um, I've never done that. So I wanted to have something that like clearly labeled if they make me pull it out for any reason, like I would just know, like this is my meds. They both have my name on them. These are the best little Neutrogena makeup remover wipes because you get them in the little individual packs. So instead of taking a gigantic pack of makeup wipes, you just take what you need. I genuinely cannot do my makeup without this. Okay. This is, I use this for other things. I have like a bajillion of these little bags, but this is a little, a little bag for your toiletries. And I love this little set because it has a spot for everything. So you've got two little tubs for like lotion, uh, creams, whatever. I'm gonna take some LMS cleansing balm because I legitimately don't feel like I have washed my face unless I use that. So it comes with two small. This one actually comes with two large as well lighting in here is a little crazy these i don't plan on washing my hair while i'm there but i do 
Yeah, I spray magic mist on my hair every day. So I'll probably still take one of these. And then it comes with two large and two small regular bottles. So like face wash, body wash, shampoo, conditioner. If I do end up washing my hair, I always take that stuff because you just, you don't know. <laughs> you don't know. So I'd rather have it, not need it, than need it, not have it. And that is it for this vlog. Um, it has been a very good day with both boys. I was very happy with better this, this day was than last Wednesday. Um, Ezra did not take a nap until like two o'clock, which was not fun, but we made it. He was very cranky when it was time for bed. Like as we approached like 6 p.m., I was like, Gremlin, who are you? Why have you done my sweet baby? Because when he woke up at four, he like wanted to do nothing but cuddle. Like it was so precious. He never, ever, ever wants to cuddle anymore. And Roman is like, if he could glue himself to me or if he could still be attached to me by the umbilical cord, he would be. Like Roman is a Velcro baby, even at 14 months. Um, so it was really sweet. And then it was like a little switch just flip, flipped and he was gremlin energy. So anyways, I'm gonna get in the shower now. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you tomorrow.